the old look it's very natural and clean Mecca because we wanted to keep the ADN uh, of the, um, the brand. So the girl is chic and sporty. So we, uh, we work on the complexion with the foundation a little bit matte to give a matte effect. And uh, we worked this year on the intensity of the eyes. So we didn't want it something very smoky, just like a, a touch of light on the lids. So we use it a bronze color, so make a really nice shine on the eyes. All the importance is given to the silhouette of the clothes, which are amazing. It's winter, it's very covered. Lots of volumes and lots of amazing volumes. So small head, very sharp ponytail, very sharp line on the side, kind of a satin finish, not really slicked. We're blow drying the hair straight with a Masson Pearson and the help of thickening spray from Bumble and Bumble, which is a kind of a light hairspray. So it doesn't glue the hair, it doesn't slick it too shiny, but it's still very clean. The guys are similar idea, a little looser, a little more sporty in a way. Well, it's time we started like with this idea of like a, an Antarctic exploration. So like, the base is like very, very white and very mineral the colors of the, of, the, of the grays, and then you know there's some kind of three accents of like three primary colors, like the orange, the green, the blue, that just come like as, as accents. I'm wearing a like white total neck and white pants, white shoes and raincoat. It looks really cool because it's see-through, so you can see all the details like what I'm wearing inside. So it looks amazing. There's a lot of volume and a lot of like the outerwear is very cocoonish and protective. There's there's different layers in them so that you can wear it like separately and then all the insides are kind of very ill-fitting as well and kind of like I think the idea of like comfort but still stays sexy at the same time. wearing a wool blue dress with stripes in black and um, the shoes are like a boots with an elastic on the ankles so it's really comfortable There's, there's uh, all sorts of wax cottons and double, double fabrics, double, double wools in contrasting colors, a bounded leather with, uh, with, uh, with jersey as well. And it's kind of like mainly the, those three main axes. Uh, gray pants and also gray sweater with uh, like uh, a landscape painted on it. I think it was a landscape, maybe it's like an iceberg, I'm not really sure. Yeah, it isn't really like tight, it's like more like loose. Yeah, it's really comfortable. Yeah.
yes, I, I looked back, but just uh, the iconic fabric, the PK, that we, we bound it with all sorts of different fabrics, so we gave it a whole a whole new texture and like garments that are much more constructed. And so and the idea was to look ahead, actually. So it's just to become something very iconic and to do, to really put like the brand in a perspective of, of you know, trying new things and, and slightly futuristic, very clean, uh, but at the same time very comfortable and super functional. I think it's you know it's very fun as well to have such a rich vocabulary and like, so, so much history. So it's kind of you know each season is like what do we look at and how do we how do we take it forward and how you know how do we reinterpret things. So I think that's kind of part of the fun thing. Yeah. 